capacitor for for my the app I'm building. And every time I'm trying to, uh, if I follow the instruction to make the icon on capacitor, uh, I get a, an error. Not an error, but uh, well, actually yes, I get this error over here. Error occur while the copying resources foreground. So when I went to the uh, the for the resource for the, I see that there is no uh, the foreground that PNG is not here. So I went online and I you know Google Google error while creating. And then I found this page from the, the Android developers that you actually uh, can do uh, the icon, the app icon, right uh, from the uh, Android Studio right here. So I'm going to show you how I did it. Uh, I'm not aware uh, of any solution right now from the capacitor from Iconic, Ionic uh, developers. So. Uh, you can try this, uh, maybe it's going to work for you. It worked for me. As you can see, I have the, uh, the icon here, but we're going to change this one to for... This is an, an app I'm developing right now, so we're going to change this icon for another one. What you have to do is go into Android Studio. You follow this instruction in the project window, select Android View. We're going to do that now. Uh, project is right here. Android, so we're already there. Go to the app. I'm gonna have a couple of folders. Go to the app, and then it says in the rest folder, new image assets. So we're gonna create that. Go to the rest, and you can see here in mid map, I already have the icons foreground. Before, now before was the Ionic uh, uh, icon, so I already changed it for uh, this one. You can see here, we're gonna change this one for the other one. So we're gonna click, uh, right click, and then create. Okay, I'll do that. Rest, right click, new, go all the way down, image, asset. You can see this is the icon. We're gonna uh, upload a new icon. You go to Path, Open, uh, where you have you the new icon. I would recommend the 5, 512 by 512. Open. It's already here. We're gonna go Next, Finish. And there you go. You go now to Foreground. It should be this one now. Close this one. Double click. This is new, the new icon. Now you're gonna have to restart the uh, the whole emulator again. Usually, with this button, apply changes and restart. It should work, but sometimes it doesn't. So let's try this one first. Uh, otherwise, we're gonna do the whole build the whole app again. And there you go. This is the icon now.